um, uh, he chose gate uh, number 13, which gives you two consecutive races when you'll start on gate four in heat four, and then you'll go to gate one in heat five. And if Wolfenden can pick up at least two points here, he'll be satisfied and then utilise the inside gate. Could have five points out of the first two rides. Great way to start the Grand Prix. He is desperate to win. He's been second three times. He wants to be on top of the box tonight, that's for sure. Absolutely right. Maguta, though, can he make it four wins from gate one? Here, Maguta's made a decent start. Now, what can the man in blue, Freddie Lingwood, do? Woffenden has just been pushed to the back to third place here. Now he's going to try the inside run. Oh, oh no! Big crash! Lingwood oh, pulled dear. a big locker going into turn three. Woffenden really had nowhere to go. And that was a really awkward moment for him. You've got to remember Woffenden's coming back from a broken back. That's the worry. So, we can confirm now that Ty Woffenden is disqualified as the primary cause of the stoppage. So, in the opinion of the referee, Ty Woffenden caused the stoppage of that race. Well, if you see it again, Freddie Lingwin's pulled a massive locker right in front of him. There's no way Woffenden would have run into him if he hadn't have done. So, I, I, I just, again, I, that, that, that is a decision that I, I disagree with. Freddie Lingwin there. It's almost coming to a standstill. He's pulled a massive locker and Woffenden just had nowhere to go. He's run straight into the back of him. What was he expected to do? To jump off the bike? Well, he's walking back, which is great to there, see. There, you see, like, Woffenden just can't avoid him. So to add insult to injury, he's been thrown out of the race as well, which I, I don't agree with. He's not really there happy. He's, there he's, he's not just, happy. He's just, no, and, and rightly so.